Raise your hands up, up, up. Hey, what's going on, Charlie here? Gene. Thanks for tuning in to Multicasking today, Gene. Yes, thank you. We, yeah, thank you for coming over and having, having a chit chat we with us. We appreciate you guys yeah, watching us. Spend time with us, appreciate that. Uh -huh. uh, today, Gene, we're going to try the old Ezra seven year old Kentucky Straight. Seven year from Lux Bur Row. Lux Row. You're wearing the Lux Row? Oh, you're you're look wearing look the, look wearing look the shirt of the band that you're going to go see. Nice. I am wearing the shirt. Uh, so this is a seven. That heavy pour, probably. Yeah, I bet you will. Seven year old. This is a barrel strength. Barrel strength. Yeah. Um, this is 58.5 ABV, 117 proof. Um, distilled and aged in Kentucky. Lux Row Distillers, Barktown. I got a mash bill for what it. What is the mash bill there, Gene? 78% corn. 13. 12% malted barley. And what's the rest of it? 78, 12, 13. 78, 12, 15. 78, 12, 10. It's okay. He's, he's my associate. Your degree, <laughs> your degree is in math. My degree is not in math. Uh, the 10% is the right. Right. Yeah. Um, Yes, uh, we were huge fans of the old Ezra uh, distillery pick that we picked up at the distillery that was 12 years old. Right. This is seven. We're going to find out if it's You know, tasty. for it only being 10% rye, I'm getting a lot of rye notes out of this here at Feller. Uh, first thing that comes to mind is sweet tarts, Man. dust, oak. There's like a... Making my eyeballs water a little bit. With what? Uh, alcohol fumes, I think. What? Cast strength. I yeah. prefer barrel proof, actually. This is barrel strength. They combined the two, didn't they? So you got barrel proof, you got cast strength. This is barrel strength. They combined the two things. Double. Double. That's, a, that's like our, our triple entendre, our double entendre shirt. We have a shirt that says multi casking is multi casking, but it's multi. I like malt. Anyway, mm -hmm. it's kind of what, what they did. Malt so I malt. get um, dark cherry and orange at the same time. Uh, I get, I, I'll give you a, uh, like a cherry cough syrup. Is kind of what I'm getting. Cedar. There's like a some cedar yeah, wood, real good. heavy cedar wood. That's a good wood note. Yeah, this comes off. Uh, did you, you said cherry already, didn't you? I did. Yeah, like uh, cherry cough syrup. I just said that. Yes. Cherry cough syrup is what I'm getting. Um, there's a there's some chocolate in here too. I can't tell if it's milk chocolate or dark chocolate, but there's definitely a chocolate <sighs> note. Yeah, there is maybe a, like semi sweet uh, chocolate morsels. What the hell is a morsel? You know, like you put in chocolate chip cookies. Those are morsels. That's actually their name. I don't know. I thought they were just called chips that are made out of chocolate. I don't even know. <laughs> More okay. <laughs> there you go. There's like some pine. There's like a heavy Christmas tree pine in here too. Yeah, I'm getting it. It's starting to open up now with a ton of oak. Yeah, let's just let this guy open. Open man. I'm getting a bit of the I'm getting a bit of the caramel now. Like I get out of an Elijah Craig uh, small batch. Getting some caramel. Getting some caramel. Okay. Like an Elijah Craig small batch. All right. Yeah, I'll give you. I'll give you some of that. Um. Yeah. That. This is more oak tannins than I than we had last night. Uh, I'm having to go in because I'm not. I'm, I'm struggling. I'm struggling to get more than this, than what I've this already got. This I do. I, if you've not said furniture polish, I'm I'm getting that um, that that uh, lemon furniture polish. You okay? That is a punch in the mouth of flavor. Did not expect it to have that much flavor. See? Mm, mm. Told you. Oh, 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 wait, wait. Told you. Man. It matters up. It starts out real subtle. You know, like, oh, I don't even know where the flavors mm. are. And then your tongue is like. There they are. Yeah, there they are. The whole band came. They're freaking parading through the freaking taste bud town. So when we're nosing it, I'm nosing yeah. it like I'm nosing a 40. Forgetting that it's barrel strength, um, but all the flavor of a barrel. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say cast strength because barrel strength is bugging me. Okay. It's got all the flavor. I'm gonna say barrel proof actually because I prefer that. It's got all the flavor of a barrel proof. Uh, tons of so got oak tannins, but tons of caramel, cherry, touch of your black chocolate, 
got or touch your chocolate morsels. Chocolate morsels. It's got the um, oh, man. Bit, a bit of a marshmallow, like a of a burnt marshmallow is my I'll finish. Give you a, I'll give you a burnt marshmallow up on my tongue. I will give you that. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm. Thank you, Forrest. <laughs> uh, yeah, for me, the finish is burnt marshmallow. Mm. Um, oak. Man, I, I don't like marshmallows, but I'm digging this finish. Mm. Normally, I don't like, I'm not a marshmallow guy. It's not, I'll take it in a rice crispy cookie, and that's about it. If we're camping, I'll, I'll take a s'more. Yeah. Won't, won't request it, but if it's offered, I'll take it, because you're camping, you should probably have the s'more. You have Right of passage. Right. Um, what else can you do? Hmm. So I, if somebody would to, were to make a cherry butter, a cherry butter spread, this is what I would think it would taste like. It's got the the black cherry and the and the sweet creamy parts of the butter. Mm. And then you spread it on my tongue. Mm. Now we talked earlier. I think I'm gonna do well, another one. Who talked earlier? Well, we talked earlier. Is is this the exact same stuff as as the Lux Row? Right. I was asking yeah. you. I'm like, I wonder if this, because sometimes distilleries will. I don't know if the distilleries or the bottlers will. So we picked. The, put the same thing yeah. in two different bottles and just put different labels on it. We picked this one up at the distillery. It's 12 years old instead of seven. It's only one ABV off. This is a um, hundred. 18 that's 118.4 that's 117 and we really liked this stuff yeah yeah we, so really we did. didn't we were curious if this is the exact same stuff just five years different i'm not certain of it um the the water drop even brought more rye out for me i'm getting the spearmint now <clears throat> and the and the thyme and the sage for only 10 percent rye i am very surprised i'm getting so much, so many rye notes. Well, I'm a big rye guy, but you're much better at picking up rye notes when it's 10%, 12%, 13% than I am. I'm getting it on the nose. I'm not so much tasting the rye as I'm just smelling the rye. Hmm. I get more of that sweet tart cotton candy note with the water with my mouth closed. Well. I'm gonna go on a limb here, folks, and say it brought out more peppers. It cranked it. up the peppers. My goodness, you know what it is? It's like the pepper be like, I'm here, just a little bit of pepper here, a little bit of pepper in your hand. And then a drop of water be like, stir that some gun up. We're stirring that some gun up. We got some peppers up in there, and then just this, right in your face. Yep. Yeah. Sprayed you with peppers. Yeah, I get the spraying part. The peppers in my eyes. You're welcome. Um, I'll get more oak now, get more sheetrock dust. Oak definitely um, gets more oak. I get you more peppers, but it's still got a long finish. It's got, it's got, it's a, Very long finish. some whiskeys you can eat with the fork. I say this you could eat with a spork. Uh, it's not quite forkness, but it's more than a spoon. So mm -hmm. uh, it's a thick, oily mouthfeel. Yeah, yeah. Feels actually a little bit older than seven for me. Um, I could see eight or nine. We're gonna do some scores. We're gonna do some scores, and then I gonna, think I'd like just a little versus that real little, quick. Little touch of it. Yeah, memory serves. This was phenomenal. Yeah, I just want a little touch of it. Just, yeah. Just a little tip. Just see if you like it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm struggling on my score here. Um. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm gonna stick with it. What'd you do? 90, I, 90, did okay. 90, I did a 90 on this. We've been pretty far on our pretty far apart on the scores of late, but as of late, we're starting to. Come on, come on. You want to do a little? We got these little. Yeah, just those little, little fellers right there. Little is fine. Volunteer shot glasses. Yeah. Now, oh, what did you pay for this, Jean? Oh yeah, let's go through that. Um, so this MRSP is for forty. MSRP is for forty. MS, yep. Yeah. Uh, but I think we we spent seventy four is what I have written down here seventy four. Oh wow! So, so so somebody has some upcharge on it. So. Yeah, I mean, but forty is pretty cheap, I think, in my opinion, for for this because there's a lot of goodness. Look at yeah, it's it's. I wouldn't pay more. I would not pay a hundred for it. Um, 
it's definitely worth the price you paid for it. Yeah, yeah, I think it's definitely worth it. There's these are completely different noses. It's not the same thing. Nope. Not even no. close. Not even close. Uh, this smells like everything you want on your palate, and comparing them, now this smells bottom shelf. I mean, to me. Oh, there, there. This smells like a rye to me, and it has the whole time. This smells like a bourbon. Damn, that's good. Um, actually, I think they are comparable. They're comparable on the palate. Honey, I'm home. Yeah, I think they are comparable. They you might, think so? they might be the same thing. If yeah, you know, this is this is dark chocolate raisin. Yeah, peppers. this is better. This is also five years older. It's very this comparable because it's one year off. Yummy, yummy in my tummy, tummy. Mm -hmm. Do you still have a notes for this in your book about what the mash bill is? Got it. Okay, I'm gonna go on a limb before you tell me. Uh -huh. I'm gonna say they are identical mash bills. Am I correct? I don't have the mash bill on that one. <laughs> you just said I got it. Well, I got the notes, but um, oh, no we, mash bill. We couldn't find the mash bill. You, oh, that's right. You thought it was a rye mash bill, though. Okay. You, rye mash bill question mark. So you thought there was some rye in here. That's right. Because I definitely know that there's this. This has got rye. Yes, you can only get this at the distillery, or at least you could only get it at the time of a purchase. We haven't researched this in a year, um, but when we picked this up a year ago, you could only get it at that time in the distillery. Uh, no spoiler alerts, but we kind of liked it. Um, get this if you can't find this. That's going to be what I'm going to tell you. Huh? This? What? Oh no, I just, uh, I was looking for this, You're, you said, eat it with a fork. And I was wow, like, oh, did you say eat it with a fork over here? Because I thought you No, I said you eat it with a spork. Spork. Yeah, so same same quasi notes, which makes sense. Seven year, 12 year. The water so, brought the sage out on the, and rye notes on this guy. Yeah, this. Cranked up peppers, orange, marshmallow, and cinnamon is what we had on that guy. Okay. Um, I'm going to say, I'm going to limb here. Completely blind of knowing the answer, but I'm gonna say these are the same thing. This is five years old. We paid like 115 for this, didn't we? 175. 175. Yes. Okay. So. $100 MSRP, more on, for that guy. MSRP this at 40. Yeah, but five for 75. 100 dollars more for this. Five years more. Um, I'm not upset with the 175 dollar price tag on this, but if you can fit, get this for 40. You get that for forty, not to those, not to not. block your face there. Apologize about that. Oh, it's okay. I mean, if you can get if you can find it for anything under than seventy four, it's going to be worth it. Yes, under seventy. It's good. <laughs> if you can find it for actually anything, if, even seventy four dollars in my opinion, yeah. it's worth it. So heck yeah, um, uh, yeah, I like it. Kudos to Lexro for putting out some quality products. Mm -hmm. um, if you want to send us some free quality products, email us at multicasting.com. Uh, but yes. Subscribe. Oh yeah, subscribe. Subscribe. Subscribe, it's free. Uh, anything to add, Jean? I have nothing else to add. I'm Charlie. I'm Jean, and I hope you are just as thirsty as we are.